Praise the Lord that we can stand alone in his power for our salvation and our lives even now. Colossians chapter 3 verse 16 declares as Paul penned essential words to the believers of the church of Colossae, let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. That word dwell is a rich word. It has the idea of to tabernacle with. To abide with. To live in. I would imagine everyone here today has a house or an apartment. Somewhere that you rent or you pay a mortgage on or maybe you own that at some point you signed a lease agreement. You signed a rental agreement. You signed a mortgage note. And you didn't do that to pay rent or to pay the mortgage month by month and then live somewhere else. Why did you do that? So you had a place to live with yourself or your family. So you had somewhere that you could call home. Paul writes, let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. The word of Christ should be at home in your heart and in your life should be living in you it's a part of you that is so important to our life the word of christ represents a vital resource for the believer